No, thank you. The economy will be front and center tonight on Capitol Hill when President Obama addresses a joint session of Congress for the first time. Chuck Todd is NBC's chief White House correspondent. Chuck, good morning to you. Well, good morning, Meredith. Well, the president has rarely missed an opportunity in these first 36 days to be front and center, whether it's formally, like he'll be doing tonight in that speech to Congress, or informally, like he did yesterday when it, uh, when it looked like a scene from the British Prime Minister's question time. The President of the United States. It's not officially a State of the Union, but the President is treating it like one. Since taking the oath of office, the president has spent most of his time dealing with economic issues. If, if uh, the private sector was just humming along and uh, we could just make government more efficient and not have to worry about uh, this financial crisis, I would love that. But that's not the circumstance we find ourselves in. So but tonight, the president is expected to outline the rest of his domestic agenda, including health care, education, and energy policies. Aides say much of the speech will echo familiar themes. And modernizing our costly health care system, we're making the largest investment in education in our nation's history. How we produce and use energy is fundamental to our economic recovery. On Monday, the president laid the groundwork for his speech by hosting a so-called fiscal responsibility summit, holding court in a way official Washington had rarely, if ever, seen before, giving friend and foe alike a chance to speak their minds. From Republican Senator John McCain. You, Mr. President, have to make some tough decisions about not only what we procure, but how we procure it. To the head of the AARP. Uh, the, the whole entitlement thing is, as you've characterized it, uh, we have a real sustainability problem. To some of his most loyal supporters. I think that what we're doing here today provides a framework for us to really get some things done for the people of our great nation. And he even promised to find common ground with his new congressional nemesis, Republican Eric Cantor. I'm, I'm going to keep on talking to Eric Cantor someday, sooner or later. Uh, he, he's going to say, boy, Obama had a good idea. Well, now, tonight's speech is going to be, obviously, those three big issues. Also expect Iraq and Afghanistan to come. But I want to focus, folks, on health care. If there is one next big fight that this president is ready to take on now after he's got a stimulus package passed, it's health care, and that could dominate the next couple of months. All right, Chuck Todd at the White House.